We've heard your stories on the campaign trail. We have been touched by your dreams. And we will fight for you every single day that we're in Washington because Joe and I are committed to leading a government that is accountable not just to the wealthy or to the well-connected, but to you. To the conductors who make our trains run and to the workers who lay down the rails, to the parents who worry about how they're going to pay the bills next month on the commute to work, and to the children who hear the whistle of the train and dream of a better life. That's who we're fighting for. That's who needs change. And those are the stories that we will carry with us to Washington. Those are the quiet heroes who've made this country great. You can find them in every city, in every town, in all 50 states. They work hard. They look after their families. They sacrifice for their children and their grandchildren. They are you, and they deserve, and you deserve, a government that represents the same enduring values that you live out in your own lives. Yours are the stories that will drive us in the days ahead. This is the moment that we have to come together for the sake of our country. For while we come from many different places, as Americans, we share a common story. And now it falls to us to carry forward that American story to make it our own. Now it falls to us to ensure that everyone in this country can make it if they try. Now it falls to us to pick ourselves up, to reach for the promise of a better day, and to work hard every single day together to perfect our union once more. Thank you very much, Wilmington. Pray for us. God bless you, and God bless the United States of America.